Benetton Group, Benetton Group SRL, is a global fashion brand based in Ponzano Veneto, Italy. The name comes from the Benetton family, who founded the company in 1965. Benetton has a network of about 5,000 stores in the main international markets. In 1963, Luciano Benetton, the oldest of four children, was a 30 year old salesman in Treviso. His initial small collection of sweaters received a positive response in local stores in the Veneto region, and soon after he asked his sister and two younger brothers, Gilberto and Carlo, to join him. In 1965, the entity known as the Benetton Group was formed. In 1965, the Benettons opened their first store in Belluno in three years after in Paris, with Luciano as chairman, his brother Gilberto in charge of administration their younger brother Carlo running production, and Juliana as a chief designer. The company's core business remains their clothing lines, United Colors of Benetton, and Sicily. The group has a network of about 5,000 stores around the world. The company is known for sponsorship of a number of sports, and for the provocative and original United Colors publicity campaign. The latter originated when photographer Oliviero Toscani was given carte blanche by the Benetton management. Under Toscani's direction, ads were created that contained striking images unrelated to any actual products being sold by the company. Up to 1982, Benetton marketing campaigns relied on traditional models wearing the brand clothing. In 1982, the company decided to change its advertises campaigns by focusing on world issues to raise awareness and create an added value for the brand. In 1984, Oliviero Toscani photographed the first multiracial ad for the brand. These graphic, billboard-sized ads included depictions of a variety of shocking subjects, one of which featured a deathbed scene of a man dying from AIDS. Others included a bloodied, unwashed newborn baby with umbilical cord still attached, which was highly controversial. This 1991 advert prompted more than 800 complaints to the British Advertising Standards Authority during 1991 and was featured in the reference book Guinness World Records 2000 as most controversial campaign. Others included a black stallion covering a white mare, close up pictures of tattoos reading HIV positive on the bodies of men and women, a cemetery of many cross like tombstones a collage consisting of genitals of persons of various races, a priest and nun about to engage in a romantic kiss, pictures of inmates on death row, an electric chair, an advert showing a dark-skinned boy with hair shaped into the devil's horns, three different hearts with black, white and yellow written onto them, and a picture of a bloody t-shirt and pants riddled with bullet holes from a soldier killed in the Bosnian War. Most of the advertisements, although not all, had a plain white background and in most the company's logo served as the only text accompanying the image. In autumn 2011, Benetton launched its new worldwide communication campaign, an invitation to the leaders and citizens of the world to combat the culture of hatred, and created the Unhate Foundation. This campaign was created as the group's corporate social responsibility strategy and not as a cosmetic exercise. The Benetton group seeks to contribute to the creation of a new culture against hate. Benetton's Fabrica Research Center partnered up with 72 and Sunny to create the Unhate poster series. According to Benetton these are symbolic images of reconciliation, with a touch of ironic hope and constructive provocation, to stimulate reflection on how politics, faith and ideas, even when they are divergent and mutually opposed, must still lead to dialogue and mediation. 72 and Sunny adds United Colors of Benetton returns to the cultural conversation with a simple and powerful message of tolerance. Unhate hate and love are often in a delicate and unstable balance. This campaign promotes a shift in the balance. However, these posters of the lip-locking political and religious figures have sparked controversy. In addition, Benetton released an advertisement that displayed President Barack Obama of the United States and President Hugo Chavez of Venezuela kissing. On November 17, 2011, the Vatican announced that it would take legal action against Benetton after the company used a photo purportedly showing Pope Benedict XVI kissing Ahmed Mohamed El Taib, the Imam of the Al Azhar Mosque in Egypt. Benetton responded, We reiterate that the meaning of this campaign is exclusively to combat the culture of hatred in all its forms, said a Benetton group spokesman. We are therefore sorry that the use of the image of the Pope and the Imam has so offended the sentiments of the faithful. In corroboration of our intentions, we have decided with immediate effect, to withdraw this image from every publication. In November 2017, UCB launched a campaign in collaboration with Dibhumi, a registered company owned by rural women from remote villages in Uttarakhand, state of India. 
The initiative claims to empower over 6,000 rural women artisans across India. Benetton Group entered Formula One as a sponsor of Tyrrell Inn, then Alfa Romeo Inn. This arrangement was extended to both Alfa and Tolman Inn. Benetton Formula Limited was formed at the end of 1985 when the Tolman and Spirit teams were sold to the Benetton family. The team saw its greatest success under Flavio Briatore, who managed the team from two. Michael Schumacher won his first drivers' championships with a team in end, and the team won their only constructors' title in 1995. From, the team raced under an Italian license although it continued to be based, like Tolman, in Oxfordshire in England. The team was bought by Renault for 120 million US dollars and was rebranded Renault F1 in 2002. In 1979, Benetton first sponsored their local rugby team, AS Rugby Treviso. Benetton Rugby has since become a major force in Italian rugby, with 11 league titles and supplying many players to the national team. Benetton Group has also sponsored Treviso Basket and Sicily Volley. Benetton has faced criticism from Mapuche organizations over its purchase of traditional Mapuche lands in Patagonia. The Kirinongto Nahuilker family was evicted from their land in 2002 following Benetton's claim to it, but the land was restored in 2007. The company had published a position statement regarding the Mapuche in Patagonia. Benetton aroused suspicion when they considered using RFID tracking chips on close to monitor inventory. A boycott site alleges the tracking chips can be read from a distance and used to monitor the people wearing them. Issues of consumer privacy were raised and the plan was shelved. Benetton's position on Refid technology is also available on their website. PETA launched a boycott campaign against Benetton for buying wool from farmers who practiced mule sing. Benetton has since agreed to buy non mule said wool and has further urged the wool industry to adopt the PETA and Australian Wool Growers Association Agreement to end mule sing. Benetton's position statement on the mule sing controversy is available on their website. On April 24, 2013, the eight story Rana Plaza commercial building collapsed outside Dhaka that housed one of the factories where Benetton makes its clothing. At least 1,130 people died. Benetton first denied reports linking production of their clothing at the factory, but clothes and documents linked to Benetton were discovered at the disaster site. Of the 29 brands identified as having sourced products from the Rana Plaza factories, only nine attended meetings held in November 2013 to agree a proposal on compensation to the victims. Several companies refused to sign including Walmart, Carrefour, Bon Marche, Mango, Aachen, and Kik. The agreement was signed by Primark. Lobla, Bon Marche, and El Corte Ingalls. A year after the collapse, Benetton faced international protests after failing to pay any compensation to the Rana Plaza Donors Trust Fund. Protests included shutting down Benetton's flagship Oxford Street store in London. On April 2015, Benetton Group announced that it has doubled compensation for Rana Plaza victims recommended by independent assessors and applied the principles of the Accord on Fire and Building Safety to global suppliers. Benetton's engagement for Bangladesh is available on their website. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.